Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, invest in a detector, specifically the bear one, because I do want a bit better quality detection. And I'm gonna get another one of these lead lined in the container. That sets me back a bit. That's not too bad. And I'm also going to switch out my weaponry for something a bit more practical for what I have in mind next. Just gonna unload things here. So I want to actually go back to the dredge station when it's daytime and I want to get some revenge and get some artifacts. So that's the reason I bought another one of these containers. I do fortunately have uh, I do have scopes for everything and I do have a silencer for the rifle so I will be actually going to buy another silencer or suppressor specifically for the AK there uh, and I fortunately have quite a bit of uh, ammo for that AK so that'll come in handy. And this is actually quite a nice AK too, it's got some nice uh, modifications there and it can take an optical scope. So I think with this loadout I'm looking pretty good. Attach things here. Looking good, looking good. And Owl should have at least one suppressor. I believe that's it right there actually. 45 by 39, yep. And it's not too expensive, it's not bad. And that's pretty much all I want from Al. And I don't even want this weapon so I'm gonna sell it. And my mistake. I did forget to pick up the scope that I still have for this rifle. Uh, and in case you're wondering where I got all this stuff, it's from some previous episodes. Um, I was just basically looting dead bodies for a large amount of time in order to try to build up some wealth. So I got almost 6,000 here. Not a bad amount. Uh, and I got my nice bear detector, which should come in pretty handy. But uh, yeah, it is late, so I will be going to sleep and getting up early in the morning for some adventure until 7. Alright, it's time to eat. Pretty good. And I do have... Yeah, I think I'm fine. It's time to head out. Now, I believe the stalkers at Dredge Station are still going to be hostile to me because I did shoot their uh, friend who tried to rob me. So I'm going to have to figure out an intelligent way to eliminate that threat as well as not create any new threats in the process. And I would like to do it by going up on that hill, kind of taking them out from up top, but uh... Oh, looks like there's uh, dead boars over there. Huh. Looks like there might be some meat still. But I'm a little bit um, wary because the bandits might be up there. I don't want them to shoot me in the back. There could be dogs up there. I don't want those guys to shoot me in the back. Any number of things could uh, pop up. So, it'll be interesting to see how well this works out. So 
So I think... Wow, I'm already low on stamina. What is going on here? Guess I just ran too much. Too much weight for my own good. Yeah, that's gone. Uh, oh, I'm almost at max ideal capacity. Badly decayed. Oh, of course. Oh, it was still worth checking. Anywho, it's time to go up on top of that hill way over yonder. Still looks pretty clear of bandits, that's always good news. Bit of a traffic jam over here. Anytime there's a little hitch in uh, FPS like that, I always suspect that it's because something's spawning. Sounds like these guys over here on the left are seeing something. Oh no. Okay. Just the range here. So this is how much magnification I get with this. How much am I going to get with this? More or less the same. I'm not even sure if there really is a difference among any of the scopes. I mean, I know that they read as though there is a difference, but I believe it was uh, the complete mod for Call of Pripyat where it really there wasn't any significant difference. Um, and ever since then. I've never quite been sure. I don't remember really encountering other than like the obvious differences like the difference between the Ventores and an AK scope. You know, obviously there's going to be some difference there. I really hope I don't walk up on something I shouldn't be walking up on. Okay, nothing on that side. Doesn't look like there's anything up here. What about up further on the hill? I don't see anything, so it looks like I am clear to ambush stalkers at dredge. The bad stalkers, mind you. I'm not just willy-nilly attacking stalkers, I'm attacking people that suck. I don't know how good of a shot I'll be able to pull off from here. But I know both of those guys are hostile. And is that a third over there? No, that's a piece of the dredge station. Okay, so I believe it's just those two guys. Kind of see if I can get a better shot here, but also scope the area out for dogs. Like I'm clear. There's flushes over there. Well, that's not working. So I got pissed him off. Eat it. <laughs> it's just walking right at me. That was it. That was all of them. Cost a bit more bullets than I wanted, but I'm pretty satisfied with that result. I just, uh, 
I hope that doesn't create other problems. Oh my god. Man, I hope these guys don't decide to take shots at me. But I really gotta get... Oh my, what what is up with this radiation? Now they seem to be perfectly fine with this. Oh man. I bought that detector. Ah, I guess I shouldn't have bought that detector. Oh well. It happens. At the very least, I could sell it and make a nice amount of money. Are these duty or stars? I wonder. They look like duty. Привет, брат. Stalker. Well, it seems like, uh... They're, um, kind of aware of the douchebaggery of these other guys here. Well, that's good. The last thing I want to do is, uh, get in a vendetta with the rest of the stock community. Very nice. Very nice indeed, and I'm so glad I bought two of these containers. Or I brought two of these containers, I only had to buy one of them. Kind of wish I had bought more than that. That's pretty cool though. Not sure how to get back up here. Maybe I'll just walk through this junk here. It'll be interesting to see just how effective this uh, artifact business is. Got a bit of bullets out of that, got some grenades. What is this? Cleaning stuff. Customized Makarov. That's kind of cool, actually. Good haul today. Good haul. Wonder if these stalkers would give me any uh, money for this detector. I think I remember more or less how much it costs from Beer, the uh, basic detector. I think it's something like 2,045 or some odd number. Let's see how much this guy would give me for it. Practically not much. <laughs> Uh, almost 900. Almost nothing for that AK. What is AKSU? 70, AKS 74 u okay. Oh, you give me 100 for the rubles. What else? Grenade. How much did you give me for that? 82? Yeah, beard gives better, better money. Yes, le нужно что? Спрашиваю главного. Вон старший стоит. Так ты к нему обращайся. Check out this uh, detector here. I want to see how helpful it is. Actually, I think those stalkers already picked up the artifacts. Yeah, I think that's what happened. Because otherwise I would be seeing the little trail in the water of the artifact moving around. Yeah, I don't see it. They pretty much cleaned it up. Well then, it's good. That was definitely a full trip right there. And they did all the work for me. Suckers. Let's go see how much beard gives me for this.
I did check the prices with Al for ammo. They seem kind of reasonable. About 15 of these uh, AK rounds will get you... Uh, it'll cost you about like 1,100. More or less what I expected, but not as atrocious as I expected. I honestly expected something like 3,000. So, good to know it's not too unfair. Or too ridiculous, I should say. It really isn't such a thing as unfair in this mod. It's not a bug. Man, my stamina is just... Oh, that's why. Almost 50 kg there. Taking off the helmet should help. Put a little more distance between me and the hill over there. So if there are bandits, it'll be harder for them to hit me. Also, it seems like cover is actually pretty effective in this mod. They can't really shoot at you effectively when you're behind cover because you can't see you. I like that touch. Time to see what we can do. Like you said, добро пожаловать на борт нашего болотного ледокола. Keep that macro off the. Doesn't need anything I have. Hold on to the AK for the moment, because I want to compare it to the one that I already have. It gives better for the detector, that's good. Before I sell that to him, I'm going to check with uh, Al how much he'll give for that. Ooh, what is this? Morphine? That could come in handy. Alright. And right after I check this with Al, I'll sell those artifacts and so no get out of that. Ну что? Ну что? Okay, he gives slightly less. Давай, давай, Not не задерживайся. Surprising. That's the way it should be. Al is supposed to be the one who has more ridiculous prices at the beginning. Вот такой. Yeah, pretty good. Now, to quickly sell these artifacts. I'll just sell one of them. I might want to keep one later. Once I get some artifact application containers. How much is this thing taking off of me? Sell, sell, sell. Okay, 2,800 basically. Not that bad. Where are the stats for this thing? Is he gonna let me see the stats? 
now. Well, anyways. So it adds about... Like six... Plus six percent radiation per second. Something like that. The reason I want to hold on to one of these is because of the thermal there. That could come in handy for the one of the little side quests right next to the dread station. How much can this okay, so getting one of these, I might be able to wear one of those artifacts. But it's very expensive. <laughs> that is so expensive. It's not even I don't even have that much money yet. See even that guy over there is laughing. It's crazy expensive. Yeah. Well, I might be able to sell one of those meat chunk artifacts. So I'll go ahead and try that. Oh, the bandits won. What? Frickin' gun. Doesn't work. Stupid gun. There's like two left at least. And I need to kill them because I can't run with this much stuff on me. You know what? Eat a grenade. I'll probably damage the equipment, but I'd rather have the equipment damaged than myself. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> oh, nice. Good stuff.